everyone, my name is Alexis, welcome to, or welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to hang out and complete my to-do list together. So if you don't know if you've been keeping up with my channel, I recently just got back to school after spring break, so I have a whole like list of things I need to do to get back and settled into my school routine, so I thought it'd be fun to hang out today and do those things together. My to-do list for today is my dishes, grocery shopping, cleaning up my coffee bar, social media engagement, and studying for a midterm I have on Wednesday. To start this video off, I actually have an appointment I need to run to, so we're going to head there first. And then after that, we're going to start off this to-do list by doing grocery shopping. Alright, we're currently en route for the grocery. <laughs> Okay, grocery store number one did not indeed have coffee creamer so now we're going to head across campus to a different grocery store and see if they have coffee creamer because literally the only groceries i really need to get today that we're on a mission for we are back home now and you will never guess who went just a little bit too hard at the grocery store so, the main thing I wanted to say was creamer, which I mentioned, but there were a few other groceries on my list, and it, you can predict. Um, I went in for two items, and I came out with, like, seven. So here's the haul. First of all, they did not have coffee creamer at the second grocery place I went to, so I ended up just buying half a gallon of milk. My thought process being I have an espresso maker, so milk means I can have coffee because I have enough creamer for one more coffee, and if I don't have coffee, I'm going to lose it, but I cannot drink black coffee. It's too bitter. So I got this, and I'm just going to make lattes until I can get my hands on more creamer. Next, I got three Chobani flips for breakfast. I love Chobani. I got the peanut butter cup flavor and then the s'mores flavor. There are not a large variety of flavors on campus, but these are my favorite that they keep here. I also got holy guacamole minis. These were on my list. I got two Olipops. I got the tropical um, punch flavor. I'm going to try this one. I heard it was very good. And then the orange squeeze, which is my favorite. A little salad that is literally so cute and a Nitro Pepsi to drink literally right now. I told myself I could get this or go to Starbucks. I decided to get this so I didn't have to walk to Starbucks and it is cheaper. There's also a rumor going around that they're going to discontinue these. So I'm just gonna say it now. If Nitro Pepsis get discontinued, I am going to be the most upset person on this planet. Okay, let's go put these away now. Okay, so our next task for today's to-do list is to clean up and upgrade my coffee bar, which is right behind me. I'm getting super sleepy, so maybe it's like appropriate that we're going to be cleaning up my coffee bar, but my energy is definitely going down uh, a lot, so I am depending on you guys to keep me motivated so I actually finish everything on my to-do list today. The biggest upgrade we're going to make to my coffee bar today is actually a under cabinet light that was sent to me by Azoko. In this video, it's actually being sponsored by Azoko. And there will be a discount code in my comment section in case you're interested that will get you a percent off of your purchase. We're going to be unboxing and setting up this under cabinet light that is going to go like right here under the shelf above my coffee bar. Here is the light. So here's everything that came in the light kit packaging. So first it comes with a charger to recharge the light. And then it comes with these two magnets that you stick onto your surface and then the light magnetically attaches to them. And finally it comes with the light itself. So this is what the light looks like. It has three modes on, off, and auto. And the auto can work as like a night light motion sensor feature. Some of the things that I love most about this light is the range of different like temperatures of light. You can have cool light versus warm light. I love how easy it is to install. I love the fact that it is renter friendly since I live in a dorm and will be moving into an apartment soon. So knowing that it's something that I can use in different spaces without it damaging surfaces is amazing. And I also love that it has a like motion activated 
function to it because coming over here late at night sometimes I like to make tea and knowing that I can just get up and come over and make tea and this light will just turn on and I don't have to like turn on my overhead light just to make a late night cup of tea when I can't sleep is honestly so amazing. So thank you so much to ASCO or ASOKO for sponsoring today's video. I will leave my discount code and the link to this product in my description in case you're interested in checking it out. Now that we've finished installing my light from ASOKO, I'm going to go ahead and move on to our next task, which also kind of relates to the coffee bar, and that is doing my dishes. I've only been back from spring break a few days, but I eat in my dorm literally all the time, so my dishes have been piling up, and I don't want to procrastinate doing them until I am like a week behind, so we're going to go ahead and pile up all my dishes and go take them out to the kitchen to wash them. After I finished doing my dishes, I honestly took a little break off camera before I decided that I was just going to get studying out of the way. I had a midterm in one of my marketing strategic communication based classes that I was extremely stressed out about. So here is a montage of me trying to study and prepare my notes for it since it was an open note, open book exam. Anyways, this is your sign that if you've been putting off studying to get to it because you do not want to be like me and be studying at the last minute because you did not prepare ahead enough. All right, it is a little while later and I am done studying for today. So I have a midterm in a couple days as I've talked about. And I need to study more tomorrow, but I did what I need to do today so that way I can study more the next couple days. Like I'm, just, I'm on track and I'm happy with that. I don't really have the energy to work ahead, but honestly, getting a little bit done is better than getting nothing done at all. And with that being said, we've completed my to-do list. So thank you guys so much for hanging out with me today while I ran errands, did my to-do list, all that. I had a lot of fun. Um, don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe, all that stuff. If you are interested in the light I mentioned earlier in today's video, check my description for a personalized code to get a discount on your own under cabinet motion sensor light from ASOKO. And don't forget there's also going to be like a link in the description as well. Uh, thank you so much for watching and I look forward to seeing you next week. Bye.